Hi guys, Nagraj here. Welcome back to my channel. If you are new for this channel, please do subscribe. So hi guys, welcome back to another video. In this video, we will see how to remove the duplicate element from the array list. Okay, suppose in this example, if you consider these are the data for the array, like 1, 2, 2, 3, 4, 5, the expected output will be like 0, 2, 3, 4, and 5. Right? This is my expected output. So I have removed all the duplicate element here. So this is my expected output. How we can do that? So what logic we can use that? Suppose I have uh, mentioned like I will take index is equal to 0, i is equal to 0. So this is the zeroth index. The zero will be in the zero uh, zeroth index, and again this zero will be in the one index, index one. This is two, three, something. So it will goes like this, right? So again, I will take one more uh, variable j is equal to one. Okay, just I will tell you why I am taking this one. The logic uh, we need to use here to remove the duplicate, something like, see if I consider j is equal to 1 what I am doing so I will indicating these positions okay this index is index I started from the 0 and j I starting from the 1 so how we can use that see consider this one okay let me uh, write uh, I have written some small piece of logic here so if array of i here what I am doing I am just checking array of i and i plus 1 okay array of i and i plus 1 I am checking if these two are not equal okay if these two are not equal what i am doing i will do some operation so in this case it is equal right array of i and i plus 1 is 0 i just increase the i value by 1 okay i am i am in the i i will be in this position now right so now i am again checking with the i and i plus 1 so now i is 1 i plus 1 is 2 position right and it is checking these two value in this case it is i and i plus 1 is not equal to it is not equal right in that conditions i am moving i plus 1 means this one to the array of j so array of j is pointing now to the first position right so what i am doing i am moving this element to here this i positions now i will make j plus plus now this pointing to here now so what it means so at the end so at the end array will looks like b so this is the position it will be 0 now we are replacing 0 with the 2 now it is 2 now right now again once it is not equal to 0 i incremented j plus plus so now j is pointing here now again i am making a, in the next loop i will compare uh, my i is equal to 2 now so i am comparing i and i plus plus now again it is same so i am not doing anything so just i am incrementing the i okay again i am checking i and i plus one again it is not same again i am if it is not same what i should do i need to move i plus one okay i plus one to the array of j now j is pointing to this location right j is pointing to this location now i am moving this three to here right now the value of three will comments it here again checking the same thing next loop i and i plus one again it is not same again i am so once okay before that once i move this value my j i am incrementing here right so this, this is the increment i am doing so once it is not equal to 3 and 4 is not equal to not same so i am moving 4 to the array of j so now after 3 the 4 will commence it here again one more loop 4 and 5 are matching it is not same so since this j is here now 5 go and sit here now after that 5 will come okay that's it so this is my expected output so after that 4 and 5 will be there here okay there is no issue 4 and 5 will be there but my requirement only this much is my expected output because i have removed the duplicate so this i will get based on the j now what is the j's position j position is here right 0 1 2 3 4 5 so total count is 5 this 5 value i should get as a output this is my expected output right okay so we'll see how we can do it in uh, the eclipse okay, i have taken one uh, class here in this public static wild main let me declare one array we'll try to do the same thing first i need to declare one array 
okay first i need to declare an array that i am doing now it should be the int array as i am the taking an integer value int array arr equal to let me declare some variable here okay let me check some duplicate value zero so anything you can take nine so this is my input what's the expected output my so expected output will be zero two three four eight and nine this is my expected output so how we can do that so as i said first i need to declare one uh, variable j that i'm going to declare now so int j is equal to one okay should be int int okay j is equal to one so now i need to move this loop actually one by one i need to take so for that let me take for loop so i to take minus one because the array index starts from zero so this should be i equal to zero sorry then so when this is done i need to apply this logic okay i need to apply this one so how to do that if array of i then what i need to do i need to move that j into array of 1 then i need to make j plus plus now that's it so it will uh, go and save respective value now i need the output right how many counts is up let me display that as well okay system dot out the value count let me take some count here j will just display the count for me how many uh, value we have in the array so let me use the for loop just to display those required data okay unique data so int a is equal to zero here i less than or equal to j okay less than j on the use because till j i want those data and j plus plus so here i can display all the data this dot 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 11 array of i so if you want some so i don't want to print in next line in the same line i want to print that's why i will use some space this should be i right i plus plus not j that's why it is not going in finite loop let me run it again see here this is the expected output the output is so input you provide 00233489 the output i expected output i got only unique data so let me give some other value as well we'll see whether it works or not we'll give some four four let me add few more duplicate value and nine or something eleven so if i run this see here we got only the unique data so total value count is six and till six we got this data okay so hope you understand this logic how to remove the duplicate uh, as they mentioned like sorted array we need to give in, uh, values in the sorted order only here just your logic we need to apply and you are displaying the output thanks guys thanks for watching this video if you like this video please hit like button and Share with your friends those who are looking for Java concept and don't forget to subscribe this channel for further useful videos. Thank you.